from the Scripps Studios, this is 10 News. Good evening, I'm Vanessa Van Hefti with this 10 News update. San Diego's boardwalk scooter ban went into effect Saturday. Riders who get caught using any scooter on any boardwalk will get a warning for the next 30 days. But starting April, those who get caught will get citations. Supporters of the ban say they're glad boardwalks will be safer. Protesters argue the ban shouldn't punish those who practice safe riding. San Diegans got a chance to cast their votes today ahead of Super Tuesday. The Registrar of Voters opened four satellite locations in Spring Valley, Chula Vista, Carmel Mountain Ranch, and San Marcos. Officials are hoping this event attracts two types of voters, those who have not registered and want to file provisional ballots, and those who are registered as no party preference and want to vote for president. Hundreds gathered today at Bayfront Park in Chula Vista for a free circus. It was a gorgeous day for face painting and watching performers clown with the audience. Circus goers marveled by high acrobatic performers and contortionists. The event was hosted by the Port of San Diego Arts and Culture Program. More than 700 people there for future events like this one. If you missed it, be sure to check out the Port of San Diego's calendar. Christina, now we'll look at your forecast. And unfortunately, a little bit of weather is coming our way. We're going to be dealing with some snow down to 3,500 feet. Rain chances also for most of the communities in our viewing area. That continues through Monday. And then we do have some gusty winds for mountains and deserts. Here's how your three-day temperature trend looks like. A lot cooler tomorrow and Monday, but then a warm-up is back in the picture for us on Tuesday. For the inland communities, you're looking at high 50s for Sunday middle to low 70s by Tuesday. For the latest news, weather and traffic, go to 10news.com or download our free 10 News mobile app in your app store. For 10 News, I'm Vanessa Van Hefty.